right guys so I was asked to review this Mifa gel nail polish collection these are soak off UV LED nail gel these are also 10 milliliters and there is 18 pieces in this lot Alright, so let me come back. Here we go, guys. It comes in this really nice velvet little package here. It's real nice and velvety. You get 18 pieces in this, which one is a top coat and a base coat. Okay, let's not break a nail. And let's see if I can pop these out of here. So I'm just going to take a utensil here and pop these out, guys. So we have here, this is their top coat. They are plastic bottles. And it says tips. Why does it say tips? What? Any problems, contact customer support to get faster support. That's all that is. We're just going to tear that off. Alright. Alright guys, so I'm just going to go ahead and take all these out. <clears throat> please, please, please overlook me coughing and sniffling and stuff guys. I, I'm like, I don't know what's going on. So on the back it's going to tell you your ingredients here. It's going to tell you it's more than 14 days lasting. Nature material and non-toxic and low smell. It's required that you have an LED or UV nail lamp suitable for all kinds of nails for for gel art starter and pro personal use. It tells you the warnings here. You know, do not apply to a nail that's damaged or infected. Stop using if any allergy occurs. Keep out of reach of children. Go to the doctor if you have eyes or mouth. And keep in a cool, dry place to avoid, avoid direct sunlight. Okay. Anyways, let me go ahead and get all these out and I will be back. Alright guys, so I'm ready. Okay, let me make sure my camera's pointed downward. Sorry, I've been playing around with it. Now, you guys know, I'm not crazy over plastic bottles. Mainly because my personal opinion is I knock these things over like crazy because they're so, they're so lightweight that I'm constantly like, whoop, whoop, or I'll be like, bump, and then all my gel's gone because I spilled it. <laughs> Anyway, so, I mean, it's not a big deal. I mean, it's just a plastic bottle, but I have the tendency to knock these bottles over. Got my big old cup of coffee going here, and we're going to swatch all 18 of these. Of course, two of them are base and top, so we actually have 16 bottles, I think. You see? 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Yes, 16 bottles of colored polish and two of the base and top coat. Now, guys, I don't know if you remember me, folks, whenever they first started coming out with their gels or their little They, I love Mifa. Mifa is one of my all time favorite, other than Maffy. Mifa and Maffy are my all time favorite gel polishes to paint with. Now, when I bought them, they were in these little tiny bottles like this. This is what the Mifa used to look like when they were. When I first started getting them in these little tiny bottles. And I absolutely adore them. They are wonderful. They they are so pigmented to paint with, guys. Like, I use these little bottles. And I have a ton of these. Mainly because, like I said, I paint with them. So, But look at how beautiful. I'm so pigmented. So I'm really excited to see this collection. I was really excited that they actually made the large bottles. But these... Large bottles are 10, millil 10 milliliters, and these smaller bottles are 8 milliliters. So, I mean, there's two more milliliters in there than the small bottles. Crazy to think of it like that, though. And it, I mean, just by looking at it, you're thinking, like, no way, but it is. It's an 8 milliliter bottle. Can't really see it. It's at the main bottom of it. And then we have 10 milliliter. Okay, so let's get into this video before I make it an hour long by talking to you guys to death. And rule of thumb, first thing that you want to do is roll that polish in, which is hard to roll in a plastic bottle too, that's another thing. 
but you just want to roll it around in your hand just kind of warm it up get that consistency moving around this one is it says MIFA 017 Oh, look at that white. Oh my God, I can already tell by looking at it. It looks so pretty. If you do not have this collection, guys, you really do need to get this. If you love painting or just even a pigmented polish, you will absolutely love these. I mean, just look at that. That's white now, guys. And normally white, I have a hard time with. Because, like I said, white is so streaky sometimes or can be really blotchy. But Mifa's white is the best. Hands, like, I grab it when I, before I grab anything when I, come, when I go to paint. Because, like I said, it's just really pigmented. It's beautiful. It's just awesome all the way around. I don't know how I got a hair on my swatch stick already because I literally just opened these. But that happens, I guess. I mean, just look. That's one coat, and it's already just, like, pigmented. You want to just glide over the tip when you're painting. You don't want to paint like this, because if you paint like this, you're going to pull the paint off. See? It just pulls the paint back off. You just want to, like, glide over it really slowly. Just kind of glide Try to make sure there's no hair in your polish. And it just leaves us such a pretty, 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 pretty polish. You also want to make sure it's thin. The thinner your polish is, the better it's going to cure. So, cure anywhere from 60 to 30 seconds, depending on your light. And I'll be back. All right, guys. So that is now it did wrinkle a little bit on me. I think I got it a little bit too thick, maybe. Let's go ahead and put a top coat over it. Um, I do have to say that um, they do feel a little thick when you apply them. And they do have a little bit of an odor to them as well. So do keep that in mind when you're painting with these. They are thick and they are very pigmented. But I do think that's because I just applied too much. I'm going to go ahead and top coat this and see what it looks like. And see if that maybe helps smooth it out a little bit. Alright, and that does look a little better. And that one is the white. Look how pretty that is. Such a beautiful white. And the top coat is so smooth. I love it. The next color is 020. Ooh, look at that color. So pretty. This one is 020. Beautiful color. I really like that. They do have an odor, guys. I don't know why, but they do. And it's this beautiful, beautiful shiny purple. Like, look at that. Look how beautiful that is. I love it. It's got, like, silver glitter in it. It's so pretty.
That one is number 29. Has this beautiful, beautiful glitter in it. So pretty. Next one is going to be 016. This is their black. I always get excited when I see white and black. I don't know why. But I do. I guess why I use them quite often. See how pretty? They're so good. Wow. Okay. And that one is zero sixteen. Really nice black. I really like it. Oops. Zero zero six. It's really pretty pink. I love it. That was just one coat of this color, and that one is 006, which it's actually a, a little bit darker of a pink. My camera's not showing it, but it's actually a little darker, more like a baby pink. Next color is 028. I'm excited for this color now. Oh my god, I'm so excited for this color. Oh. That one is 028, and oh my god, that's so pretty, guys. I love it. The little blue sparkle in it, so pretty. Alright, we still got quite a bit more left to go, guys. Hope I'm not boring you guys to death with these gel polishes. This one is 008. It's just creamy peach color. Almost like flesh tone color. So that one is 008. Next one is 003. It's just beautiful red.
that one is 003. It's a beautiful red color. Next one is 014. Ooh, and it's really, like, what do they call this color? Like sienna, sienna? No. It's more like a orange. I don't know what color they call this. That one is 014. Next one is 004. really pretty pink it's just really pretty pink and I don't know why but my camera wants to show it like a like a lighter pink but this one is like almost a bubblegum pink And this one is 004. So pretty. I love it. It's really pretty. Alright, we're getting there, guys. This one is 001. Now this is a bright red. Zero zero one zero zero seven. It's a beautiful coral peachy color. And this one is 007. Beautiful color. I really like that. Actually, I want to wear that myself right now. <laughs> and the next one is 018. Look at that yellow. That's so beautiful. And that one is zero zero. Or no, 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 no. I'm sorry. That's 018. Beautiful. I absolutely love that yellow. That's such a pretty bright yellow. Alright. This one is 015. Ooh, 
it's a very nice brown. I always love a good brown. And that one is 015. It's a really nice brown. This one is 002. That one is number zero zero two. And the last one is zero thirty three. Beautiful purple and holographic glitter. And that one is 033. That is so pretty, guys. Look at that. Love that holographic glitter in it. Alright, guys. So that is all 16 colors with a top and base coat that you get in this collection from Mifa Nail Gel Polish from their little um, collection here beautiful colors um, I did apply two coats to each one um, they are already top coated I did use the Mifa top coat on each one the top coat is actually beautiful super smooth shiny applied really easy cured really fast they cured in 30 seconds and they were completely cured all the way through love the glitter polishes absolutely stunning love this one right here this one is beautiful guys but they're all really nice i really like them i think they're well worth having um like i said you know i'll leave that link down below for you guys so that way you can go check them out um it's a really really nice little collection to have and like i said i love painting with them not all of them are as um easy to paint with though i don't i wouldn't think like this one's probably too sheer um, you just have to work with them, see what you can paint with, see what you can't paint with, but definitely have to have two coats on some. Some are just one coaters, but anyways, guys, I really enjoyed the collection. I hope you liked the video as well. Make sure to hit that big thumbs up button down below. Go ahead and subscribe if you are not subscribed to this channel. I would really appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed the video, and if you are already subscribed, thank you so much for all your love and support. Some of you guys have been really great. And I love that about you guys that you are always here for me. And I really, 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 really love that. But anyways, guys, hope you're having a great day. Make sure to leave me a comment down below if you have this collection or if you like this collection. Or what you even think about it. Hope you all are having a blessed day. Bye.